I think in general we have an amazing family here. The residency really is like a family. I remember when I was first looking into residency program and one of the things that they always harped upon was the wide variety of patient cases that they see here. Things that we haven't seen before, or we usually just read in textbooks, are actually seen here and we're actually managing those patients ourselves. So that gives you a wide variety of different type of medical complaints that you're able to learn and grow from. I was lucky enough to be recruited as faculty here in the program uh, about eight years ago now. And what really drives me and keeps me here is to see uh, how residents come in and um, you know, a little anxious, a little afraid of, of taking on the challenge of residency and then you see their growth and development over the years. In essence, as faculty, you're able to reach so many lives by teaching your residents the right approach to medicine and giving them that confidence and knowledge that they require to go out there and take care of their patients. Within the, even the first few months of my residency here, I've already had a chance to do a lot of hands-on procedures and things in the hospital as well as clinic. That has included things like paracentesis, bedside. I've had the opportunity to do ultrasounds, uh, not only in prenatal visits, but I've had the chance to look at uh, cardiac issues and heart failure with bedside ultrasounds in the hospital, inpatient setting, just within the first few months. So I look forward to doing so much more in the coming year. Being from Stockton, there's so much diversity here that I don't think gets enough attention and I think that translates to the residents here and even to the faculty. I don't know too many other places you're going to see a diversity in faculty like you see here. It's, it's commonplace, it's normal here and it's, it represents so much of what Stockton represents and I think that's something truly special about San Joaquin General Hospital. So some of the unique cases um, that we see here and that have kind of kept me excited about medicine is we just had recently disseminated coxy. We had cytokine storm secondary to Hodgkin's lymphoma that hasn't been treated for four years. You will learn how to manage the patient that has DKA plus hypertension. You will learn how to manage that as a package. And I think opportunity to help residents realize that as a family medicine physician, you can practice outpatient medicine, but you are equipped to practice inpatient medicine as well as urgent care medicine, and it really is a wide scope of practice that you can do once you graduate. So there's so much to do in our area when it comes to the outdoors. It's, it's just incredible. The staff in the clinics and the residents, we really hang out. And if you're into the outdoors, and I think it's a great way to recharge, um, especially when you're in residency um, and here as faculty, that's the way I love to recharge, is to be outdoors. Many of the retreats, we also have our staff join us, um, and that, of course, builds teams and uh, allows for a better working environment um, day to day. We actually have been doing residency training since 1972 at the inception of the specialty um, and one of the first programs in California. So to the question of what is the applicant that we're looking for, I would answer someone that's a team player, someone that understands that we are a family here and that it takes all of us together to get the job done and care for our patients. We have three years together to uh, train the best physician there is. And then you see them on the podium, right? Giving their, their farewell speech. And really that, that's what, what keeps me here because I see the growth and development of an excellent physician. As faculty, you're able to reach so many lives by teaching your residents what is the right approach to medicine. And giving them that confidence and knowledge that they require to go out there and take care of their patients.